Hello again, YouTube. I am Aznap, and today I am going to be sharing my experience with what is appropriately named Hell's Itch. Now we're gonna hear you all saying, "Oh, oh, oh, Has Hasnap, what it, 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 is Hell's Itch? I've never heard of this. Did Mr. Black Darkness cast a spell upon you? Did a did, did a satanic fly give you malaria in your sleep?" Were you assaulted by netherish butterflies that coated each and every inch of your body with satanic juju dust, originating from the birthplace of humanity, Bumblefuck Ethiopia? No, 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 not, nothing like that. It actually began when I set off for vacation, vacation, vacation last Thursday. See, I went up into the mountains of Colorado to Telluride and it was a stunning place really really quite beautiful but on my last day there I went to a pool and considering how fucking high up I was I mean I was on top of a mountain um and how close I was to the sun and being the white male I am sorry to all of you who thought I was a busty black woman I don't aim to disappoint I got cooked quicker than instant ramen that young hasnap was smoked and roasted like fucking chicken. So, oh well, right? White people problems. Burnt, it hurts, it peels, it's itchy, it's annoying. Ripperino cooked with pepperinos. It's exactly what I thought. But Monday night, I was playing some video games, quick scoping some potatoes on Club Penguin, and finally decided to go to bed. So, as I was laying in the darkness, I had an itch in my chest and on my arm and I'd and I did it and scratch it but it it wouldn't go away and seemed to just get worse and considering I'm trying to fall asleep and I'm not a very patient person I got frustrated hella fast so I'm walking to my brother's room and starting to scratch frantically and I asked what the fuck do I do he had no idea, so he said, just hop in the shower. I then. So, after about 10 seconds of warm water running down me, and the itch being ever persistent, my back all over began to itch, and on my shoulders, and just everywhere. Now, this burning urge to scratch my sunburn was unlike anything I've ever experienced before in my life. It's indescribable. It was something you couldn't possibly hold out from and i started freaking the fuck out and so it was so itchy all over the best way i could describe it is that it feels like you have flies biting you all over your body it was an itch so bad it makes your body contort and it was just it's all over the worst part of it though is that no matter what i did i could not make it stop it was quite frankly terrifying. I, I remember rolling around, scratching all over my body, thinking, shit, is this really happening? Is this real? I wanted to tear the skin off my body. It itched so freaking badly, man. And after my mom woke up and gave me some itch cream as I writhed on my bed, did absolutely nothing. If anything, it made it worse. And eventually, after looking up some ailments with no success, I was left to the ridiculous. An ice cold bath with oatmeal. Now I had become so desperate, I was willing to do anything, and naturally jumped right into the bathtub. And it definitely supplied some relief. I was so terrified and frantic, I had become hysterical, and it was the worst thing I have ever experienced in my life. Just not knowing that this would ever go away and having already broken my sunburnt skin from scratching it, I was just so scared and horrified. It was awful. But after about what felt like 20 minutes in the tub, I began to shake and shiver all over to me being a tall, rather skinny fellow. So continuing on with the ice bath of oatmeal, that young hasnap was not looking too good. Still with uncontrollable desires to itch all over and having laid down in icy water for almost an hour, having been dealing with that for two hours already, hypothermia was a real threat and my body was just so exhausted and weak I couldn't go on anymore and just began to give out. 
So I got out of the bathtub with some assistance and the itching had both died down and a little and had been numbed away enough that I was able to collapse on my bed and pass out on contact. Thus ending this nightmare. Now I felt like sharing this experience for it's just something I needed to get off my chest and hopefully was able to make it a little bit entertaining. So moral of this story is if you a white boy, you must beware the drop on my mixtape for this shit go and make rice gums roast look like fucking nothing. I am the sun. I am a burning fucking star. You will be triggered. By the release of my album, your skin will burst into flames. Believe that. Now, if you thought this video was hot, drop a like, shitty like incentive. I know. Anyways, I'm gonna head out, guys. All I got for you today. Uh, thank you all for making it this far. If you did, peace.